This morning we're going from Vetrala to Sutri, uh, 24 kilometers. Uh, we start out on a not so exciting road, but it goes into a forest, which is beautiful, and we can get water there. So don't forget to fill your bottles. Coming out of the forest, uh, a little way further along, we come to the church of the Madonna di Loreto. Uh, the important thing is the wall opposite in the farmhouse, farmhouse a bit on the corner, there's a uh, bar relieve, which is all that is left of the altar of uh, a temple to the god uh, Mitri uh, of Roman times. It's quite extraordinary that this should have remained there and it's very well worth looking at. It's a foretaste of what is to come later in the walk. Um, from there, being very careful, we cross the Cassia. It's extremely dangerous crossing, do, do pay attention. Going into the, uh, along a, an unmade road, into the noccioletti, the, where nut trees grow. And uh, the path sort of runs out, so keep your, uh, keep, pay attention to where you're walking and the direction you're walking in you will see some magnificent oaks and under the or near these oaks you will find the, the ruins ruins uh, two of uh, Roman times and one is medieval called the Towers of Orlando um, from there on you walk uh, along a beautiful path with very pleasant things to look at uh, into Capranica absolutely splendid little town where it's very agreeable to stay and have lunch. It's rather late in the day, but it's, uh, it's the only appropriate place to stop for lunch. We continue along uh, an Etruscan road uh, and into perhaps the most exciting part, a, a very, very beautiful walk in absolutely magic woods. The, it goes on for some way, uh, finally ending up on an unmade road, which is not so long but conserves the biggest surprise of all, the skyline of uh, Sutri, which is absolutely magic. And uh, after taking a few photographs and continuing on from there, we come, we walk along beside the necropolis, uh, also very remarkable, and it ends up in something more extraordinary than all the rest, the amphitheater, the Roman amphitheater, which is all carved out of the rock. It's quite remarkable, and that's the end of the walk for today.